We've been waiting a while for Apple to implement keyboard and mouse support on their mobile devices. With the new software updates such as iOS and iPadOS 16, we're getting very close. But is it close enough? So with apps such as PUBG New State, there is a lot to offer such as keyboard and mouse support, which most people did not know they had natively. Now, you can't change the keybinds yet, but that's very hard to do due to the fact that developers need to remap keys for every single movement of the game. So if you're walking forward, they need W, and you can't change that around right now because the developers of PUBG um, haven't yet, and I don't know if it's possible yet or software updates are stopping that. But right now, our topic today is we are getting very close to the support of this. And here's an example. So as I've been talking about earlier, PUBG New State does have keyboard and mouse support natively on the iPad and iOS, iPad OS 15.5. And if you do have concerns or questions, please leave it in the comments down below. Uh, I'll say it one more time. You cannot remap the keys as of right now. All right, so here's my keyboard and mouse. This is my dock. It's connected with USBs, wireless. I push W and look at this. I'm moving forward, D, like look at all this. Even the mouse works. When I move the mouse, look how smooth it is. Very smooth. And this is an iPad Pro. It is running at 90 frames per second right now, which is also a beauty. C, crouch. Z, lay down. And then I need to get used to all the controls like eyes inventory equals is auto run and sprint and all the other controls. Q is um, quick scope to the left, E is quick scope to the right. And of course you can punch and everything like look at this. And then you could scope with the right click. So that's pretty cool. I will do some gameplay later uh, if you guys want it. but. Most people did not know that they offer this natively, which is very cool. But everything is working perfectly fine. I mean, like, look at this. Coming in for landing. This is my first game, by the way, playing. And G is to roll. Um, I already have a gun. Let's see if I can scope. Yes, I can. Let's see what the weapon to pick up is. How do you pick up a weapon? Um, F, maybe? And G is to roll. Let's see, F, F, no, T. I'm just gonna start pressing random buttons. Maybe this one you could pick up. Oh, it auto picks up, that's why. You have to change some settings. But um, basically, yeah, I mean, everything's working. You can also use a scroll wheel to change weapons. I'll need to figure out what sprint is again. But um, everything is working and this FPS is just amazing. Let's, let's go get a kill and uh, just show you a lot of these lobbies are bots i believe because it's not a popular game as of right now i mean it is pretty popular but not in the region i'm in so you could scope you can do everything and it works with keyboard and mouse that's why i'm very very excited to announce that and i'm not sprinting right now i just realized that but there we go they're sprinting now so I'm very excited about this, as you can probably tell. Um, I'm just ready for what they have to offer next. Uh, game developers, is it's in their position now because Apple announced in iOS and iPadOS 14 that the input controls and everything, there's links on their channel on Apple's website and everything. Uh, go check it out. It does show that it's not really Apple. It's the developers that need to input it into the game. So... That's basically it. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next time.